the truth. Sometimes God gives a dictator, destroys another dictator. But as soon as that dictator finds himself stronger as God and see himself as a big tree who expands his power via his branches to feed the birds, people the angels give power the gods apostles in the world to cut that tree and its branches and make its base solid for only God is the power and will people have heavenly fly for sometimes God choose you to stop evil in this world you must be wise and with help of Holy Spirit bring God's message in an effective way that you have your safety remember that God doesn't share his grace with anybody if people tell otherwise then they are not God's child for they want to push people to accept them and praise them God chooses who becomes king or leader, but those leaders or king who obey God's will are successful in God. But those who become selfish and only think on the to abuse their power to push people in the hard life are going to lose God. Worse is that they encourage their people to do the same or worse things to uh, to the this whole uh, region goes the hell. But the between pre presidents and king, the people in one region choose their president. Therefore, they must choose wisely. Sometimes they make people fool, and people find themselves in troubles of their false choice but those people who are wise and have God in their mind find the best president or king in their region amen support those who God has chosen and gave the word like prophets and Jesus praise them and God glory give your worry to the God and Jesus and trust on their timing only fear God and Jesus be strong in your belief. Give your problems to the God who is the right solvers and pray Jesus to guide you in your path. If you step and find yourself in wrong way with help of Jesus, return to the correct path. In the name of Jesus, Amen. Find the true churches to be there and find yourself a part of that. When you see a visitor, accept and let he or her come in God's and Jesus' protection and glory. Amen. Hubris is a level higher than selfish, demanded and see themselves greater than others. Imagine if a king or a leader is a hubris, what is happening in the Bible stands that they are destroyers. Those people who see themselves greater than others fall down. Hubris falls down deeper. Hubris does evil things of holy things. Example, when people offers in the name of God and Jesus and it uses in evil ways or be seen. Sometimes people give dishes of gold or silver with their, their love to their God and Jesus, but they are used in sinful way. Is hubris big sin? But you, by your strong faith and trust to the God and Jesus, make the hubris weak. Be aware of people who have complexes. They try to push you down and be demanded. But you, with your knowledges and abilities from the God, can solve the problems they make for you. Remember that God and Jesus are in control. Then feel insured at them. You can compare your life with a kingdom. You have a family. This is your kingdom. You do your best to have a healthy life for the whole family. If you do mistake, everybody in family are hurt. 
But when you do good things, the whole family get God's glory. Remember that we have only a one God, Jesus Father, who is love and faithful. Then send your glory to the God and receive God's glory. Amen. Believe on God's grace. In this world, there are different governments. God is in work, even in the, those countries, a dictator reign. God's patience is in the people, patience. But be brave and talk about God's grace and with help of God, be free. It can take long time, but that time comes. Amen. Jesus didn't confirm that he is God. He confirmed that he is the Lamb of God and obeyed the God and whatever he told was God's words to rescue us from slavery and to direct us to heaven. Amen. Hallelujah. When you leave us to Jesus, Jesus lives in us, then have a sin free life to please Jesus and the heavenly Father God. Hallelujah. Amen. Heavenly Father God, let us reach that heavenly kingdom of the this life. Jesus has introduced us. Keep us close to you by your beloved son Jesus. Amen. 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 Frederick Professor explains that God is involved in human life in two different ways. God has created each person in a unique way. He has created the whole human history in the, the beginning until the end. He knows how we people become full of evil. He has given us a lot of holy people in the history who have scriptures to guide us and can give, save us from evil and bad people. The scriptures are God's word, which are valid in any time. God has given us abilities to keep the commandments and knowledge proper to lifestyle and the situation we are living in. God's words and knowledges are like an icy mountain on the ocean, which is completely visible. But when a wave or a storm passing by, the mountain disappears in the ocean and appears again. The words are there, even it is high because of the, the storm until the situation becomes stable and you can see the mountain beautifully there which is which the situation has been fitted to the God's words. The important is that you have faith to the God and trust in him. God is so nice that he shows us signs in different ways to keep your hope strong. Then be always awakened. Daniel 6. When Daniel was chosen as advisor, the other in the government became troubled and planned to reject Daniel. They made the law or laws and made fool of the king to sign it and he did. The worst was when a law was signed by the king, it cannot be cancelled. The law or laws put Daniel in trouble. Sometimes God will rescue his holy people from inside the storm and sometimes God rescues his people before the storm. God's action is full of educations and lessons. All depends on your faith and trust to the God and its rate of it. God's grace is eternal and it is not the same, only has different ways. God rescued Daniel because of God's grace and Daniel's good action, faith, trust, and prayers. One of God's decision is that everybody should be punished because of their actions or sins. No, one par no one's parents, children, or relatives should be punished because of one of the members in the family. Only that a person who has sinned should be punished. God is so nice that he has shown his people a sign of his grace so that person can remain in any moment in his life to keep his hope alive in any situation. 
Remind that sign and increase your hope and faith. God is working for His grace to make people nice and kind. Amen. The most important sign is the moment of baptism. The past comes under the cross and broken and forgiveness takes place and a new life starts for you become reborn. Prayers is the most powerful ability God has given to people. It brushes all storm and evil surround you. Believe that God's word are there and are valid in any time and any situation in your life. If you sometimes cannot see, as like as the icy mountain appears and disappears on and in the ocean when it is a storm. The important thing is that it exists alive forever. Amen.